Hello Beep friends and welcome to a tutorial on Google Classroom. Right now you can see I have a choice of entering two different classrooms, one for Beep 6A and B invention unit and one for Beep 6B short stories unit. For the purposes of this tutorial we are going to focus on the short stories unit classroom. Now you can see we are actually in the classroom. Beep 6B short stories unit. There are several things I want to point out to you. There's the stream, there's classmates, and about. Right now, let's focus on the stream. In the stream, you are able to post information. You can type things, and everyone in the class will see it, including your teacher. The stream is a really great way to get feedback from your teacher and also from your classmates. In this screenshot, you will notice that Isabel has typed a short story and she's received 10 comments from her classmates and also her teacher. We can all see what she has written and we can all see what we have posted and commented on about her story. The next feature I want to point out is an actual assignment within Google Classrooms. Here you will see this is an assignment called Short Story Activities there are directions and also attached documents and a video file to help complete the assignment. You will notice that this assignment is due on October 28th and that it was assigned on October 2nd. If I choose open, I've been taken to another screen. This screen gives me the chance to actually turn in my work. Right now you will notice this person has nothing to turn in, but let's go ahead and figure out how we would do that if he or she were ready to turn something in. I would go ahead and choose add, and then I've got some options here. I can upload a file, link a file, or I could get it from Google Drive, and we're hoping that you will choose to store most of your information on Google Drive and Beep this year. Let's go ahead and choose something from this person's Google Drive. And now I have the option to add it. So I'm going to choose add. Once it is added, you will notice that the turn in function is turned on. Once I choose turn in, this person no longer has the availability to edit the activity they've completed. So you want to be real sure you're actually ready to turn something in before you actually turn it in. Because once it's turned in, you don't get it back unless your teacher decides to give it back to you. Google Classroom is a great way to communicate. You can see here that I have shared a video with the whole class as an announcement. But on the screen I just showed you, you could see that there were attachments as documents. There are also times when you can attach links to other places. So it's a great way to share information and also to communicate. We hope you enjoy using Google Classroom in Beep this year.